It's fantastic to be here in North Belfast. I've spent the day here. I was in school earlier on, but this evening to be among a number of people representing trade union, workers group, community activists and businesses. And many of them share common concerns about Brexit. We had a great exchange of views, but more importantly, we left here. I am leaving with the impression that North Belfast is going to lead the way with lobbying, not just in the European Union, but also the Irish government to make sure Antishak makes good of his promise that he said that the north of Ireland would never again be left behind. Well, he has to prove that and we are up and at it to ensure that the north gets designated special status for it to be reigning within the EU. You know, many people are asking me, how is Brexit going to affect me? And I'm telling them Brexit is already in their wallet, it's in their purse. You know, the pound has plummeted, the cost of living has increased. We have got a situation where a number of businesses are planning to relocate to Europe and elsewhere to leave the North. We know that the number of people who care for us in our hospitals come from the EU. We know the standard of food that we eat and the drugs that we take are all re regulated across the EU. Now make no mistake about it, as people know, Sinn Féin critically engaged with the EU, there's a lot to change within Europe, but we cannot have a situation where part of Ireland is out of the EU and part of Ireland is in the EU. You know, there's only two options, designated special status or Irish unity, because we are not going to accept a hardening of the border in Ireland. Not now, not ever. We're in a constituency that's represented by an MP that couldn't even sell the Brexit message to his own constituency, to his own people. So what I'm asking everybody to do is to stand up and demand your rights, demand special designated status for the North so that we can protect the integrity of the Good Friday Agreement, we can protect all the benefits that we get from the European Union, and most importantly we can empower people to stand up and demand their politicians, their trade unions, their representative bodies, or even as individuals, as civic society, demand that our rights are protected. Sinn Féin, Goanna Nis, Carta Agus Eintas Naharan, Equality, Rights and Irish Unity.